Hey everybody, it's Mr. Shashimo, and I'm back again with Spectrobe's Origins. I almost said Pokemon Fire Red. Uh, and this time we're gonna go to the excavation site and find Kotetsu's apprentice. Let's see what he's doing. A lot of times we don't have to do a lot of this ring around, but, you know, shit happens. What do you expect? Alrighty. Looks like we have Crawl here, and a lot of times when you find, when you see the, um... When you see on the ground if there's a purple marking on it instead of like the yellow shinies, those are the dark minerals. If you need leveling up, that's a good way to get some, but... Oh man, I'm getting my ass kicked. A lot of times... Okay, it's not shameful to use... Ow! Your Spectrobes is meat shields. But it's actually really hard to do. Okay. Spiken's not doing so hot right now. It's okay, buddy. We got you. Who? You're a lightsaber. I was out here looking for some minerals when those crawls surrounded me. Well, you should go tell Kotetsu. You're all right. He's worried about you. You're right. I better get back to see him before he blows his top. Thanks again, guys. See you back in town. I, I hope. That doesn't instill confidence. Man, that was close. Gamark would have been in trouble if we hadn't shown up in the nick of time. You can say that again. Let's go see Kotetsu, Kotetsu and ask how the bridge repair is coming along. You'll never guess, but he's already done! <laughs> I think. <laughs> Should be. <laughs> oh, you found Gamark. You f that fool had me worried sick. Sorry for all the trouble. Now, about the bridge, I'm afraid I have some bad news. The repairs are going to take a bit longer. Oh, okay, I guess we'll just have to keep waiting. If it'll make you feel any better, you can have this. It might come in handy. An expansion cube! Ah! And blue minerals. Expansion cubes. What's this, Kotetsu? It's an expansion cube for powering up your incubator. Kotera's former Spectro Master gave it to me back when I was still an apprentice. You can use it in the incubator thingamajig you have back on your ship. It creates a virtual world that you can go in so you can interact with your Spectrobes. Neat, huh? Gina and I can enter the incubator too, but that sounds pretty far out. Thanks a lot, Kotetsu. This really comes in handy. But tell me, why did the Spectro Master give it to you to begin with? My friends, my friends, don't underestimate old Kotetsu. I was a former Spectro Master's number one sidekick. I bet he figured an that another Spectro Master would come along who could use it. Wow, number one sidekick? I guess you could re you can't really judge a book by its cover. Ahaha, that somehow doesn't sound mean when it comes from your mouth. Sorry, Kotetsu Rollins' people skills still need some work. Thanks again. Can't wait to power up the incubator. Don't mention it. If everything goes well, go ahead and try using the mineral I gave you. Feeding Spectrum's minerals is what the incubator is made for, after all. Thanks, Kotetsu. No need to thank me, my friend. I'm just trying to help any way I can. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bridge to fix. In the meantime, go try your new toys in the incubator. You bet. Come on, Rowland. Back to the ship. Oh my goodness. Expansion cubes. Oh my god. There are so many of them throughout all the games. And they're pretty much upgrades for your ship and everything, but... God damn! On the second game, there are a bunch of like, data cubes and expansion cubes, and I still haven't found all of them. Ugh. But still, that's the best thing to do right now is to go back and uh, check it out. Most of the time, you only fight with one character, and um, you know. Let's see here. Is there gonna be any any fossil or any? Guys attacking us. Go. I'm gonna check just get some extra minerals on the way. Go get him, little guy. He loves his minerals. Uh, do you blame him? There is his. He needs Go. a growing spectrobe needs all their vitamins and minerals. I got one of them. Well, whatever. Uh, the excavation site isn't actually the only place you can find fossils in this map in this game. It's just you have to wait a little bit to get more of them. But yeah. Okay, let's try that cube Kotetsu gave us in the lab system. Power up the incubator. Break a leg, Gina! Not literally. All done, Rowan. The incubator's all powered up and raring to go. <laughs> we have more incubator rooms and room types, too. Can't wait to actually go inside of it. Wow, that was quick. I thought it would take you all day. You still have no idea what I'm capable of, do you? <laughs> I'm not going to answer that. Now let's hurry up and try out the incubator. <sighs> Whatever. Well, let's see the incubator in action. Damn! Alright, we can now use the incubator if we go to Spectro's. Search team. I'm gonna go my search team. All I have is that one guy. And, um... 
Can I change the type yet? And, yeah, I can't change the incubator type yet. There are a lot of different types of incubators you can change to, but we don't have that ability yet. All we have is the mm, is the beach, I guess. Yeah, we have the midnight beach. Wow, it's good job ruining what spectrums we'd see. Oh, there's little Tora over here. Hi, guy. Hey, little guy. You can actually uh, come in here, feed the minerals. I'm gonna give him a few. That's enough until that ends, and he'll go and eat them and level up along that way. There's other things that you can do, like gear, but gear doesn't really matter right now. It helps out levels and stuff of specific guys. Whenever I feel like it, I can drop them. I can, I can auto camera on him. Uh, I can also do training stuff, but I don't have anything for training either. But yeah, I'm gonna let him finish eating. I can also film. I don't know why you, or you can like take pictures of him. I don't know, it's just kind of cute. And after you eat that last one, you can even pick up the minerals back if you need to, but... Go. You can, like... Go. Come here. You can actually kind of go over there and... They'll play with you and stuff. It's, they've got a little bit more... More attitude than you'd think they would. Especially from the original games. I mean... You know. Yay. What's that sparkle mean? I don't know, actually. I do know, but... You know. I can't exactly say it right now because we haven't gotten to that part yet. Sweet, this incubator lets you raise a bunch of spectrums all at once. That's right, it really comes in handy when you start awakening more of them. All right, let's go tell Kotetsu, Kotetsu that Kotetsu, Kotetsu that we are able to ex use the expansion cube. Yeah, and hopefully he'll be done by repairing the Dawn Bridge by now. Back to the village. Please just time skip. Thank you. I'm sure I get that we had to run back and stuff, but it's like, time skips are so nice. <sighs> Alright, Kotetsu, that expansion cube worked great! Thanks again! That's great news. I had some good news for you, too, but it seemed to slip my mind. I have some great news, too! Er, uh, oh, forges and ferrets! How can I forget? The bridge repair is complete! Great! Now we can go check out that Spectra of Master's Cave. Let's go! Whoa, whoa, hold it, my friends! I also have this for you! What's this cube for? As an ordinary cube, it's a weapon cube. It adds a new weapon to your Cosmo Link. In this case, a lance. Cool, I love weapons. Thanks a million, Kotetsu. Stop it, you're embarrassing me. Anyway, you can thank me by putting it to good use. You got it, Kotetsu. We have some work to do, but we'll be back. Yes! We get the Cosmo Lance. Okay. We're talking about different kinds of weapons, and I am going to equip them when we get new ones, just because that's the kind of person I'm going to be. I hate lances. I'm not gonna lie. Lances are extremely powerful, but they're awful to use. I haven't figured it out very well. Like, sure, like, the lance is cool and all. And also, like Spectrobes having abilities or having different, like, properties, weapons do too. These basic weapons we have are all, um, like, not strong. I guess they're just, uh, average. Like, they don't get resisted and they don't resist anything or and they're not super effective to anything i'm gonna use pokemon terms because that's what i know but uh yeah go and i will find a fight oh that oh i almost got that purple one by accident that would have been bad i'm not ready to fight with this thing just yet but once we uh get into a fight i'll show you how this lance works i hate lances i mean lances are really powerful a lot of times but i just they're just bad <laughs> I'm bad with them. There's a lot of uh, places to explore too, and I would, duh. like, a lot of times you can come up to places like this in these corners, and there are huge like mineral and fossil deposits, and it's really, really good if you want to expand your inventory. I'm a big person in collecting all the fossils I get. Oh, I guess the purple aren't specifically that. So we got a mystery pod, so that means we probably have another spectro. Next time I'm at the ship, I'll go work on that. Alrighty, you got a green one. Good job, little guy. I think there's only fire ones in this place. I, I don't want that to be the case, but... I don't want that to be the case. But I think there's only fire spectrums around here. Oh, there's a Go. bunch of stuff over here. But like I said, the um, mystery pods aren't just in... Oh, no! Oh, I love hearing that... Ah, oh, God. Oh, I'm not healed at all! Yeah, 
the lances are really hard to use. I can't even use them very well. Yeah, I'm almost out. I'm out of healing items already. Yeah, you have to charge it and then swing at it. And it's really powerful, sure. But I'm just bad at using it. Because I just get... I just... I'm not used to using it, and then I just forget about using my Spectrobe every time. Over there. Yeah, I don't like Lance. This is why I don't like Lances. I can use every other weapon fine. Except for... Okay, except for maybe one other one. Alright, you're... You're leveled up. Let's hit you over. Let's switch you over to, uh, Tora. Toka. Alright, uh, you're not Toka. You're Mayo. Boom! Yeah, I am going to switch. Oh, I hate those things. They're very hard to use, and I'm sure if you know how to use them, you can use them, but... I, whoa, I didn't mean to do that. I just don't like using them. I'm not good at it. I usually use swords in this game anyway, just because... Go. Let's get, let's get those minerals. Alright, grab that one, I guess. Let's head to the sunny grasslands. I usually do this a lot just to, like, search for items and stuff. Like, later on, we'll find items like crazy, not just minerals. Alrighty. Go. Let's see here. Which way are we going to go specifically? I'm going to explore a little bit just because I don't exactly remember which place we need to go. This big tree surrounded by crawl. Oh, God. Those, I remember those being mostly plant crawl. Why is there only one? Oh, yep. These guys, these guys will, you'll fight one, and then they'll switch into two, and then they'll switch into three, or and then they'll switch into four. Oh, good, you leveled up, that's good. Or this, yeah, they, they just multiply into a lot. The good thing about Rollin is, he levels up quickly. So you don't have to, if you're low on health, you won't really have to worry about leveling up too much. God, I hate those things. Um, I'm gonna go up here just to check around. I know I'm doing a lot of like exploring just because I don't remember a lot of these places super well. And I wanna remember where and if I see any more of those gates, I wanna remember where they are. You can pick those up as two. It's two. It's not like it's just a Spectrum's job. Why would it be just a Spectrum's job? Oh. Go. Some stuff right on that edge. Ah, Mystery Pod. Go grab those. There we go. I just leave them to do work. Right, so, Sunny Grasslands. I gotta remember exactly where I need to go from the Sunny Grasslands. You do explore pretty much everywhere. If you see those arrows, you will explore everywhere around. Uh, and in later games, you get items to help you move around. Oh, there's a save point. I'm going to heal up. I'm out of healing. Ah, there's a grass one over there. I don't have any grass guys yet, so... can't exactly use that or try it out or try to open it. Whatever. Whatever the word I'm looking for. I am going to be opening all of those as a heads up, so... Don't worry. If I miss one, I, I, at least before the final boss, I'll open all of them. They are pretty important. For later, if I would just like load. There we go. Is this where I need to go? I think so. Yeah, I think this is where I need to go. And there's those openable doors on every planet, so. Yeah, that's what I thought. Ah, bulbous bulb. Defeat all the crawl. Yeah, I kind of figured that. Yep, this is where I need to be then. I mean, crawl up here on pretty much everywhere in the map, so. It's not like. It's they're specific to like where you need to go. You'll fight crawl even if you're trying to go here just to explore. Alrighty. It's good if you if you know how to tag team, it's really good using crawl or using your spectro. Oh you missed, dude! You missed the kid! Alright. Can I not switch right now? I guess I can't. Alright. Hey, isn't the area Reduce was talking about? Rollin, wait! This reading indicates crawl nearby, and it's nearly off the charts. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, are we fighting another boss? I don't remember. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, this thing. It's not that hard. 
Its weak spot is that orangey part on its face, of course. Uh, bosses don't... Or, bosses do have elemental things, but it's a lot different than you think. Yeah, you just hit him in his weak spot. No, I meant come back. I hate that. It's a. Uh... Oh, oh God! Move, move, move. If I shake the nunchuck, I actually do. I think I do roll. Ow! Oh, I don't remember how to fight this thing. Ah, come on! I don't remember how to do rolls. Come on, hit him. Just knock him. Knock him down. Now. Go. I don't... I honestly don't remember how to fight this guy. Ah, no! Spiking! Over there. Get him. Oh, wow! Come back. Now. Yeah, I'm not super... Ah, uh, there's another... Ouch! Ow! I found another gate over there. Oh no, Spiken's down! Oh man! Over there. Oh, he's resisted! Shit! Get him. Go. Come back. Over there. Get him. Come back. Now. Go. Come back. Oh, hit him in the face! There's the weak spot. Now. Go. Yeah. There we go. Okay, I figured out how to uh, which way I need to do it. Yeah, there's a specific angle you need to sh uh, shake the Wii mode to bring him back. Over there. Come back. There we go. It's when you figure out how to do it, then it's really like Come back. it's not super hard. But I always forgot how to bring him back. Without getting him hurt. Come back. And now, of course, I figured out what's my favorite's beaten. Come yeah, Spikin back. is my favorite Spectrobe in the entire come series. Back. Over there. Get him. Oh, come on. Come on, okay, I need to lock on. Go. Come back. Okay, he's charging. I need to get out of the way. Ah, I couldn't. The thing is, I couldn't exactly uh, avoid that. All right. Over there. Just take him out. Get him. Now. Oh, jeez, he got hurt real bad. And now he's mad, of course. Yep, of course. There's always the second stage of a boss fight. Okay, I just need to find. I need to stay distance from him. Especially fighting bosses, I'm a huge distance fighter. Oh god. Go. Come back. Over there. If it looks like he's going to attack, Come I will back. bring my guy back like nobody's business. Come back. Get him. Go, go. Come back. Oh jeez, he was now. not happy. He is not happy with me. Go. I'm Come just back. cheesing this. This is how I fight this boss. This is how we fought this boss when we first fought it as a team. Because I can bring back my, uh, if I'm playing with second player, I can bring him back and move him forward. So a lot of times you'd be like, dude, just get me out of here! No oh, crap! Uh oh. I have no spectrobes now. Great. Move, move, move. Oh, okay. I can fight him, but like it does, it is little damage. Ah! Oh! He one-shot me! Oh! Ouch! Yep, mm-hmm. And now that I figured out how to do it, I died. I'm not super good at that boss, like I say. Oh. How's my team doing? That's a question I need to ask.
Okay, defeat the crawl. Okay, my team is back health. Alright. I'll pretty much uh, skip until I beat him. Did I get it? Oh, I'm really close. I'm really close. I lost Viking, but I'm really close. Got him! Okay, there we go. He's dead. That took me like three tries. I'm not super good at some of these, a lot of these boss fights. Alright. Anyway. Alright, let's see what we got here. Ah, <sighs> nothing like a nice light workout. Hey, watch it now. Don't get cocky. Look. What is it? It looks like some sort of stone. Bet it got dropped when that crawl went down. Might be some sort of booby trap. I'd back off. Nah, I don't think it's gonna explode. Negative for toxins, too. We should take it and examine it later. Wait a sec, doesn't the ground around here look kind of funny to you? Yeah, now that I met now that you mention it. Hmm. The way it's been carved out looks completely unnatural. It's almost as if something crashed landed. Well, there's no way to figure out now. Let's make our way to that cave. Right. We can always look for it into this later. Anyway, I think that's all the time we have for this episode. Uh, next episode, we'll do what it says and explore inside the cave. This is Mr. Shashimo, signing off.